Hi guys, welcome to CA Inter MCQs. We are doing a chapter of unit and batch costing. Unit costing applicable to companies which manufacture one type of product on a large scale. Batch costing applicable to companies which does the production in batches. One batch is basically a particular order that the company has got to manufacture certain type of units. Within each batch, each and every unit is similar. Also a reminder to join our telegram channel, the link of that is there in the description and to watch all the MCQs that we all put. We take great efforts as far as the MCQs are going to put them on YouTube. So therefore every student can get the benefit of them because in module the logic is not there of any MCQ. So therefore I always do ensure that I give out the answer with the logic. So let's see whatever we have today. The main point of distinction between job costing and contract costing includes, okay, four options. Length of the time to complete, okay. B, big jobs. C, activities to be done outside the factory area. Apart from that, all of the above. Now, job costing, we all know the meaning of that. Now, actually, ICA has done one error. Now, contract costing is not there in the new syllabus. Okay, ICA has still put the MCQs of that. So, but let's answer that. That's okay. Now, job costing is what? Job costing is whereby you are getting a particular order to manufacture a certain type of a unit for a customer. Okay, that is whatever is meant by job costing. Example, an interior designer, whatever he does is actually called as job costing, whereby every type of house that he makes is usually different. Okay, that is job costing. But then contract costing is what? Contract costing is applicable to companies which are there in construction business. Okay, these contracts like making a building, making a flyover, dam, bridge, etc. They all take lot amount of time to complete here. So suppose for a small example, a interior decorator got an order to make furniture for a particular house. And a construction company got an order to make say a bridge between a hypothetical example, say Mumbai, Delhi. Now, what are the differences between them? First company will be following job costing. Second one will be following contract costing. Obviously, the amount of time that will be required. The construction company will take many years. This guy will be taking few months. Second, big jobs. Obviously, because the construction company will be doing something that is very big in size. Those guys will be making the furniture very small in size here. Then C, activities to be done outside the factory area. You all will understand one thing that jobs can be manufactured in your factory or outside the factory. But construction activity will always be going or will always be done outside the factory. Like as such, you cannot make a building in the factory and then transport it, right? You cannot make a flyover in your factory and then transport it. That's not possible, right? Okay. So C also should be applicable. D, all of the above. I guess A, B, C, all of them are the correct answer. So answer should be D over here. Yeah, that's the correct answer.